Good morning, beautiful people in YouTube and Facebook land. For those ugly ones, the people with dark souls who are lurking in the background, eating their hearts out and being so conniving and evil and saying things. I got itch my finger. And saying things. Hold on a second. To try to prevent the union of my love and I. You know who you are. The ones that live miserable lives. You know that old saying, misery loves company. The ones that loved and chewed on the drama that Lina and I provided. Well, the episode of the coming separation has ended, folks. Although Lena and I have been through so much past going on four years, we are anniversary is July 16th. We survived the falling of a mountain. We've survived Lena's feeling of being rejected by her kids and family. We have survived so much in such a short amount of time that our love almost and the key word here is almost became a thing of the past and many of you out there were happy because of it whatever your interior motives are i don't know and i don't care in a relationship especially a married couple no one should ever interfere. No one should ever take sides. Because in the end, you know what? It is you who looks like an ass. I know who you are. I read the comments. I read those of you who turned against me. I don't forgive. I know who you are. So don't try to backpedal now and try to, oh, I'm so happy you guys are back together again, blah, 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 blah. For those of you who are lonely and miserable and, and everything else that are, are trying to tell her that don't go back. He's going to be this and the other. You have to realize that everything Lena said, said I had a hurt. I've been nothing but loving and caring for that woman, the woman of my life. There is no greater love no more loving person than this man that you see right here in front of you. Am I perfect? No, of course not. We all make mistakes. Who's perfect? What marriage is perfect? But one thing for sure, that both Lita and I took our vows seriously. That is why she couldn't go through the divorce, and that is why we are getting back together again. Love one. We love each other. And although we have many differences, that is part of working through a marriage, a relationship, learning to grow together as a couple. Our lives, although we've made it public, is not for you to play like a game of chess and to tell her or to tell me how I should, how we should live it. I heard people say, well, Mark hasn't made a video talking about it. Mark works. Mark works sometimes till 11 o'clock at night, you know, and lately Mark has not had the time to make videos because Mark has been talking to his wife. We've been ironing things out, making our plans, trying to get her here. You know, I had to, pay for the pain ticket. I had to, you know, send her money, find ways to whatever, you know? So no, I have not had the time to spread the news. I figure all of you watch her channel so they knew, you know, y'all got the news that way. There's been many of you whom I read comments on or whom she's told me because Lena and I share everything. Whatever you tell her behind my back, She's going to tell me and vice versa. So. I am happy to announce that my wife and I. 
are getting back together again. She is coming to my arms on Friday, a day before my birthday. people, some of you, really suck. Really, really suck. And the sad thing is, that your life is so miserable that you just feed off, you know, of other people's misery. Well, go feed on something else. Because the comings are back. And nothing you or anyone else can do about it will ever change that. We plan to grow together. We plan to work through whatever differences we may have. Because that's what marriage is all about. Newsflash. You know? Blooming! Whatever the heck your name is. There was no domestic violence between Lana and I. She's not returning because of whatever reason. Rachel and all of you. All of you misery. Misery, old decrepit, disgusting humans. Just go after yourself. That's all I have to say. Kiss my Cuban ass. Lily, my sister-in-law, I love you. Love you, love you, love you. And thank you so much for everything you've done, everything you've said, and for being there for my Lena. Anyway, guys, I love you. But remember to always love yourselves too. Goodbye, folks.